private Da Vinci painting. Yes. How, what? There's only this, one privately owned painting. It's called one of the greatest art rediscoveries ever. And that's because there are almost no Da Vinci paintings that have still survived. There are only about 20 in the world. And now this one, which a few years ago they discovered it is an actual Da Vinci painting. 50 years ago, this was sold for $60 at auction because people thought it was a fake. They thought it was painted by one of Da Vinci's students. It's called Salvatore Mundi, or the savior of the world. It's a painting, a portrait of Jesus holding a crystal, a crystal ball as you can see. Uh, it's estimated to be worth $100 million at auction. It's going to go under the hammer next month. Mm -hmm. Hopefully someone will donate it to a museum because if they don't, it will be in private hands and then people won't get to see it. So it's been in private hands until now. They kind of, they said that it used they to belong to King Charles. It, right? Sorry? They haven't said who owns it, right? They they, they have a private collector yet. right now that's putting it up. It's actually a Russian art collector. I forget it's his name. It's amazing how yeah. amazing he was. Like, I read a book about mm -hmm. him, you know, and like the anatomy. He drew pictures of like yes. anatomy. Like, how did they know this, this stuff? Is, so this is how they analyzed the painting. They, they removed layers and layers of old resin and paint and pigments. And they found this painting and they cleaned it. And they discovered that the hair was painted in a very similar way to Leonardo da Vinci's paintings. And they said that it has a very mysterious kind of air similar to the Mona Lisa they believe mm -hmm. it was painted at the same in the it same period similar, as the Mona Lisa. Yeah. Wow amazing okay right.